Hi, Seal. Hi, Gab. What are you doing here? I was searching for you, my friend. Leave me alone, I'm in pain. You are in pain? Yeah. Hey, did someone break your heart? No. <laughs> then, what's wrong? Tell me. My tooth hurts. What? My tooth hurts. Okay, 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 I'm not deaf. So, if you have problem, maybe uh, we can go to dentist. I don't want to go to a dentist. Why? I don't believe in dentists, my friend. You don't believe in dentists? No, I don't trust them. Don't worry, my friend. In that case, maybe I can help you. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm here, Sil. Put your legs down, come on. Hey, my friend, I bring some tools. Tools? <laughs> okay, maybe not this one, but... Um, no! <laughs> I think it's too big. What is this? <laughs> I want to help you, come on. No. no. Mm. Hey, this one? What else do you have? Something special for the end. My friend, look. Maybe I can pull it out. Open this door! You have to push my pull! So this little story of the dentist tells us something very simple, but very true. We are free. Free of what? Free to go to the dentist if we have some teeth problems, but we're also free not to go. In the same way, we are free to recognize God as our God, as our Creator, our Savior. We are also free not to do so. God wants us to be free because He loves us and without freedom there is no love. Let's take another example. If I am a, a computer programmer and if I could build a machine imposing in putting into the program the machine that the computer has to love its programmer, then the computer would love me. He would have no choice, he would be programmed for that. But this is not love. We are made free by God. Free of what? Again, free of choosing Him, of recognizing Him, of loving Him or not. If we are programmed to love Him and we are obliged to love Him, we would be like a computer like a machine, like a puppet. But this is not what God wants. He wants us to be free and to use our free will and He respects our free will. He never ever imposes Himself on us. So God loves us so much that He wants us free. And because of the great love He has for us, He leaves us totally free, free to accept His will, but also free to turn back away from Him. That's our free will. People can go to the dentist to get cured when they have teeth problems. And so are we invited to go to God when we are cured and to ask, we want to be cured and we ask for His help, help and we ask Him to help us. But of course, not only in that case shall we go to God. Uh, using our free will, we also invited to go to Him, to worship Him, to recognize Him as our Lord and our God, as our Savior and our Creator. We can be really grateful for this gift of free will that God gave us because it's also, it's also the biggest proof of love that He has for us. He wants us to be free. Let's use our freedom to go to Him, to recognize Him, to welcome Him. We are not obliged to. We are free. <laughs>